How would you like it if you could store and deliver all your video files, images, media files, audio files, and more all in a single platform at lightning fast speed? Well, if that sounds interesting to you, today I'll be reviewing WaveCloud, uh, which is a platform that allows you to do so. Uh, I'm going to give you a full demo, going to show you everything on the inside. But before I do so, I want to mention that there is a link in the description of this video. In case you're interested in picking this up, uh, it will redirect you to my website where you can find more information about the pricing, available upgrades, and also some free bonuses if you pick this up through my link. So make sure to check that out. All right. Let's dive into this and let me show you what WaveCloud is all about. So like I said, you can store all of your files within WaveCloud. As you can see, this is my WaveCloud account and you can simply upload your files. So here, this is the dashboard. It works really simple. You can see all my files are stored in here. I have folders in here, etc. Basically, it works just like a computer. But the cool thing is, uh, one thing that I really like is that you can upload your videos and when you upload your video, so let me show you here. So let's say I'm going to do here. This is my video. Let's check this one. MP4, Epsumo Black Friday deals, a video that I did. It's going to upload this video. And once it's uploaded, it's going to give me a full blown video player that I can embed on my own website. So let's come back when the video is uploaded. And it's almost done, as you can see, boom, there it is. And now you can see my video inside my account. Now, when I click on this, here, this is my video. I can immediately play this. It's Black Friday at AppSumo. So you can see this here. Now, one of the things that I said that I really like here is that you have an embed option, uh, which gives you an embed code that you can add to your website. So for example, this is my page builder. You simply add this embed code to your website and it will look like this. So this is a video player uh, on my website. As you can see here, it plays my video. One of the cool things is that it also allows you to add picture in picture. So you cannot see this right now. Let me add it right here. So it will look like this on your website. It's just playing at the bottom of your website. Uh, and you can also go back and then it will play in line again. So basically, you also got a video hosting service uh, with WaveCloud as well. So this is how it works. Uh, you can also share this as a single page. Now, one thing that I want to point out with a video, for example, when you upload a video, you got a settings button in here where you can also modify this video player. So for example, the primary color now is black, uh, but you can also say if your website is blue that you make your primary color blue. Also the icons, you can change the icon color. So let's say you want to change the icon color to yellow. You can do that as you can see. Uh, you can change more things. So you can add a profile picture here and you could set a title in here from your video. Uh, you could do a byline username if you'd like to. So you can add that all to your video or you can disable this, just whatever you prefer. Uh, you can enable, disable, share options. Uh, also, all these other options that you're seeing right here. So if you want to hide the logo, that's also possible so that the logo will not show in your player. And you simply hit save. And now this player will be embedded like this on your website. Now, like I said, you can also share this so you get a share link. So when I open this in a new window, it will look like this. You can share your video like this as well. Uh, and people will be able to download your videos as well. So that's only one of the features when you upload videos inside your WaveCloud account. Now, you can upload multiple files. So you can upload a folder all at once. So I can do that. I can select a folder here from my drive. And when I click upload here, it will upload all the, all the files and all the folders inside that folder to your account. And it will create folders automatically here, as you can see. So when I go to tutorials here, you can see I have one video uploaded inside of my tutorial account. So this is one of the options. Let me upload another file so I can say upload here. I can select a file. So let's say I want to upload a document. So a doc, a, a word, a word doc. I can do that as well. And you can share these as well. So as you can see, this is now a word doc and I can view and share this with other people and they can 
read this doc, when you share it, you can see it comes with a player. Now, the same thing is with PDF files as well, with TXT files. You can simply share it and other people will be able uh, to read your documents online. They don't have to download it to their computer in order to read it. It's simply there. Let me see what we have more. When I upload files, let me see. So we have MP3 files as well. So we've had TXT files, we had documents, MP4 files. Uh, but let's say we want to do an MP3 file. Let's do a music piece. I can upload that as well. You can see here, boom, it's uploaded. And I can do basically the same thing. So here it's gonna play. You see, and I can share this as a page as well. So I've copied the link. I can share this link here. Look at this. And now I can share this with other people. So basically you can upload all of your files to your WaveCloud account uh, and you will be able to share it with other people. Now, when I go here to the three dots, you can always change the things. You can download your files here. You can rename your files. You can share it. You can view them or you can delete all of your files. And then one more thing that I want to show you here is with folders, you also see these three dots here where you can click on this. Uh, you can download, rename them, or you can move them. So when I click on move, I can select the other folders in here where I want to move this towards if I'd like to. Another thing that you can do here is you click on these three dots and you click on share. And here you will be able to share your folders with other people. So you can set this to public and you can share them to social media channels. So when I open this and I copy this here and I share this, look at this. Now I've shared my folder with other people. So all these files in these folders will be shared with other people. Now the same thing here, when I click on share here, I can also set this to private and then I can share it with other WaveCloud users uh, that are in my account. So you'll need an upgrade probably uh, to see those accounts. I don't have these accounts in here, but you will also be able to share them. And I think that it will show up here in this shared folder uh, where you can see the, sh see the shared files that you've shared with other users. And that's basically what WaveCloud is all about. It's super simple. You simply upload your files, you share your files with others, and that's basically it. And thank you so much for watching. Again, check out the link in the description of this video. Please hit the thumbs up if this video was useful and uh, consider subscribing to my YouTube channel if you haven't done yet. I do a lot of similar videos and uh, check some other videos out there. Cheers.